Bonjour to the 25 people who watched my last video that I uploaded Saturday afternoon. Am I that bad? I'm still here today with my crappy accent and I'm really really happy because I will be bringing you along in a different type of video. I want to show you how I spend my day as a freelancer who does illustration and graphic design. I hope this video is not gonna bother you too much if you don't really care about art but today I really had a lot to do. I need to pack up some orders that I got from my Etsy shop. I need to catch up with Mermaid. If you don't know what Mermaid is, it's a challenge that happens every year. It happens on the month of May. Why Mermaid? And you need to draw a mermaid every single day for 31 days. We're Tuesday, March 14, and I'm still at number 11, so running a bit behind, right? I also have three new sticker sheets that I wish I'll be able to release on my Etsy shop uh, for the summer solstice, so in June. And my sister is coming to see me next week. She's coming here for two weeks. and. So I won't really have much time to work. We're going to Paris for four days and we'll, you know, walk around Lyon. I'll show her the, the city. So yeah, your girl is a bit busy. It's already past nine and I really need to start working. Welcome to my everyday reality. Let's go work, shall we? I'm done packing all my orders. I'm gonna go to the post office to ship everything. And at the same time, I'm gonna go walk this beautiful baby who's been super nice. And after that, I'm gonna do some more planning. We're back from the walk. Now, how do I keep track of everything that I have to do when I work from home? I have this shiny, shiny notebook that I write down all my sketch ideas, doodles, illustration that I'm planning to do, and it's also my weekly planner. Every day I write what I have to do in the week so I don't forget anything and it's easier for me to keep track of everything. I know many people prefer to use their phone and their computer to schedule their week, but for me it's much easier to write it so I remember and then I can highlight all the tasks that I've done and I can switch and rewrite if, for example, today I feel like I don't have time to do everything that I planned, I switch it for tomorrow. And for me, it's just easier to have a paper medium and write everything that I want to do.
I just got back from the gym. I'm so sweaty and dirty. It's disgusting. Now I'm gonna go have something to eat and I just walked Hosey. So that's done, that's good. And then I will be working on my mermaid. Today is Larry Mar. I have that to do, then the sticker sheet to finish. Uh, then after I will edit my video, so it's out tomorrow. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'll see you later, bye. Bonjour, it's me again. We're the next morning and it's about 10 a.m. I didn't end up filming my afternoon yesterday because things didn't go as expected. I FaceTimed one of my best friends from Canada and it was so good to see her on the phone. Then I answered and received three emails for possible jobs that are so cool and I'm so excited about it, but I figured out it wouldn't be very interesting to film myself just answering emails. So that's what happened. Then a little later after dinner, I went to a meetup of freelancer in Lyon in a bar. It was super fun. I met amazing people. And tonight I'm going to another meetup in another bar for freelancer. It's going to be super cool. I'm finally meeting other artists in Lyon and it feels so good, you guys. I kind of felt alone a little bit. I mean, I have my boyfriend friend and my dog but having only one person to talk every day and who doesn't necessarily have the same uh, interest as you it kind of feels you kind of end up feeling lonely a bit so yeah so that's that so today I need to run to the bank and then I need to draw the mermaid I didn't draw yesterday I will do also the one I'm supposed to draw today I will go to the gym and, and I will finish the first of the three sticker set I want to release in June. Stay tuned! I will post everything on social media like I did on Twitter and then on Instagram so yeah that's pretty much it I really liked doing this video I hope you liked watching it I was inspired by Georgia Marie she posted her video um, which was called a day in the life of a youtuber she posted it Monday and I really liked watching it so I guess that's my take on a day in the life of a freelancer and on that being said, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, leave me a comment right down below, give me a thumbs up, or a pouce, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!